Hi, my name's Harley. Today I'm going to show you how to tie a bandana. I'm going to start with a big bandana here. Uh, the way I like to start, there's these two dots in the middle. This one is happens to be the center, if you notice. I'll just take one corner, pull it over there. Take another corner, pull it there. And from this point, uh, you can roll it all the way over if you want to. And do whatever however you want to. Um, personally I like to fold you'll see how it matches up. You'll have the arrow meeting the arrow. Um, you just keep folding in half. Now this this won't leave a very specific pattern of any kind. It'll be, just be a bunch of these dots down the middle. And you write once you get to the end just fold it in half once I like to pull the ends while I'm holding the middle, tightens it up a little bit. Um, for purposes of the video, I'll show you tying method that I actually prefer. A lot of people like to do a double knot. Um, the trouble I see with a double knot, I'll show you the double knot, is, all right, there's one, a square knot as some people call it, is over time, it's actually going to loosen. It's going to loosen around your head. It's going to just get uncomfortable. The knot, you'll start to feel the knob right there, all that stuff. What I like to do is instead of tying a knot, what you do is take it same concept. You put in one loop. And then you take it and just wrap it around one more time. So there's two. Now, in the daytime, say you're walking around and it, it starts to loosen up, it starts to slip down on your head, whatever, you want it to be more tight. All you do is simply pull, it tightens back up, it stays that way for hours and hours. Uh, the nice thing too is, you know, you want to take it off for a little bit, you just undo it just like that you know you don't have to sit there and pull apart the knot all that stuff anyway <clears throat> so that that concludes this video